trying to see how much time I have to let me turn on some music real quick <coughs> and um get us going here let's put on let's put on this bob I just let me turn this down to my earphones make sure to say I'm up banging for y'all turn me up turn that down <coughs> hold on y'all let me turn this down a little bit for myself all right cool uh <coughs> People, once again, welcome to the stream. Uh, let me just give an announcement real quick to uh, all the socials, uh, if you may bear with me real quick. <coughs> uh, let me see. Uh, yep, I remember that. Hold on. I'm gonna go live two places, but I'm not gonna stay here. <clears throat> Feeling the uh, boom, boom, boom. They're gonna let the people know. If anybody comes into the live, let me know. Drop a comment or something like that. Drop some love, something. Uh, let me get my pencil ready. Let me get my tools ready. Uh, dang, it's kind of suck because I'm like holding this. Fam, what up, X? What up? What up? What up? Um, I'm not gonna stay here. I'm not gonna stay here. <laughs> I'm just on this to let people know I'm live at uh, YouTube. Sandbox, go over to YouTube. Your homies at YouTube. That's where we're going to be doing a real live session. It's not going to be here. A wall, mythical, mythical vibe, yo. I'm going to be live on YouTube, you guys. I'm going to be at YouTube. Uh, check my YouTube. It's in the bio, all right? Um, yeah, so that's where I'm going to be doing a live session. It's going to be lit. It's going to be dope. Please go over there. Um, I'm live right now, so like I need to be working on the <laughs> screen, and I'm trying to get this glove on. You feel me? Um, shoot, but yeah, basically we're gonna be going over uh, uh, J Cole's commission as well as um, Aonix's commission. We're gonna do it at the same time, so we're gonna be uh, catching back. What up, uh, Black Anime, Black Anime, Blanime, Blanime, YouTube. If you're just dropping in, go to YouTube. That's where we're doing a live session. That's where the class session is going to be. <coughs> um, for my people's popping in at the YouTube, what's up? What's up? Your boy is here. Got a little vibes going on. I'm going to turn it up a little bit so y'all can hear it. Tell me if it's too loud because I don't want to be fighting with the audios. My uh, my voice with you guys. So I mean with what you hear. Hey, what up? What up? What up? Um, yes, everybody. Go to YouTube from my link in the bio. I don't think I could, if I leave out, y'all can't get it, so, um, Abetics, uh, your boy's gonna be on YouTube doing it live, alright, so I just let people know, because I feel like a lot of people need to know where I'm at, <laughs> okay, so, for y'all at the live, hit it in a comment or something like that, I like to know when, who's here, what's here, so I could vibe with y'all, I can comment with y'all, you know what I'm saying, <clears throat> so let's do that, um, okay, First of all, let me let me break this into two real quick. Um, I am going to. These are the two commit. Whoa, what happened? <laughs> two commissions that we're working on. Um, <clears throat> also, to y'all fam in the YouTube, uh, if y'all want to know what track I'm playing and what music's playing, let me know so I can let y'all know. I was always a connoisseur of trying to find the dopest beats, bops, whatever. So <clears throat> let me know. Uh, it's good to show my face. I usually don't be showing my face. A, A K A K Cal, come to YouTube. Your boy's gonna be at YouTube doing a um doing a live. All right, YouTube link is in the bio. Um, and then just check out the live the live session. That's where we're gonna be popping. You know what I'm saying? You can see my screen. You can see it. Hear me on a better scale. Um, so go check out the YouTube. Thanks, fam. Thank you. Uh, subscribe too, y'all. Subscribe, please. Okay, so this class session, y'all. Um. Dang, I love this bop. I didn't even know I had this. I'm going through my, this is my, uh, I'll put it up for you guys. Well, it's going to be hard to see, but uh, it's my SoundCloud like list. So I'm going to be going through that. Anybody want to hear anything? I mean, uh, we're going to be listening. To okay, guys, so this is what we do. Tippy, 
Yo, we up uh, at the YouTube, so um, link is in the bio. That's where I'm be doing a class session, so please come through. It's gonna be lit. It's gonna be dope. All that good stuff. Get some good stuff in. Um, also, too, J Cole's and um, Aonyx. Let me know when y'all get here. I should just type that so y'all know. Uh, sign in. I have to sign into my own chat. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Okay, I can't even sign in over there. <clears throat> um, but yeah, y'all check the YouTube if you have a chance. Subscribe if you can. Okay, we need to get to class session. We need to get in. I've been ripping and rapping for a cool minute. Don't mind the room. <clears throat> okay, guys, so I kind of went away. All right, Sun Lane, bro. Thank you for dropping in. Man, thank you for letting me know you're here. I kind of don't want to start without them, Aonyx and J. Coles, but I think I'm going to do it because class started already. So one of the things that I want to talk about is that this one right here, this commission right here uh, with Aonyx's character, we went through a whole bunch of stuff to get here. Uh, let's pop back. <clears throat> let's do a little, uh, do a little uh, refresh. Uh, we started out with five and it's crazy because I'm going to try to remember what we were doing two weeks ago. We started out with some sketches. Uh, and then we chose Peter Hurd, fam. Hurd, hey, fam, come through, come through the uh, the YouTube. That's where I'm going to be at doing this class session, bro. Uh, I don't even know if you're subscribed to it. Subscribe to my YouTube. Link is in the bio. Uh, who was up in here? I'm in this piece. Yes, X did what? It's <laughs> a freaking dope name, fam. Thanks for the support. Thanks for the support, y'all. Like it. Like this video. Subscribe. Do all that stuff. You know, your boy's trying to get out there, trying to get these numbers up, the algorithms, all that good stuff. Your boy is hype. I'm hype right now. Okay, so back in the review, we put out some uh, <clears throat> some uh, freaking gestures, and we chose out of that. Uh, we I think we chose four. I don't. I'm, I think we chose five. Hey, Justin, fam, I'm gonna be at the YouTube. I'm just letting people know. All right, let me get y'all a little wave dash up in there real quick. Um, come to the YouTube. <clears throat> um, that's where I'm gonna be at doing the class sessions. I'm just here to show my face here. Uh, so we had moved on, we progressed, uh, we had gotten to this sketch, we was liking what was going on, I started, we just started coming up with different ideas, different areas that we could go with the, uh, with the thing, and we had looked at some of the references from before, Louise, what's up, yo, your boy's gonna be at YouTube, alright, we're gonna be, uh, link is, Louise, it was good last time, it was like a, about a month ago when you was up in here, I'm gonna be on YouTube doing the, uh, the live stream, so check in my bio, and um come through it's gonna be super dope yo and subscribe to the channel too. help you know that would really help out but basically you guys we basically got to all these different matter of fact shoot no nah, no nah, i'm not gonna flip the screen I, I want you guys to come to youtube i'm not gonna try to do four things at once i would love to but nah, i can't do that yeah louise come through so basically we ended up here um with our sketch and trying to figure out a dope pose that had uh, concentrations on the, the blade. Actually, I think we changed something. No, no, no. That's where we ended. Now we're going to go to J. Cole's right here. Um, let's go through what we did too here. Just a little run back. <clears throat> I'm trying to see where our sketches are at. Where are you? Um, they're right here. Okay. <laughs> I was like clicking forever. So, uh, also too, AB, let me know if the music's too loud, if it's not, because I want y'all to hear the bops too. We all got a flow. And this is some dope flow music. Game type, beats, all kind of goodness. Y'all get this in. So, um, yeah, we had these different thumbnails again. Uh, again, we're choosing, uh, you know, you're concepting, you're trying to come up with an idea. Uh, we had these thumbnails to kind of go through. Uh, we chose four which was gonna uh, hit the points that J. Cole was looking for. This is usually what I kind of give people. If it's a serious commission, this is usually what I would start off with. Um, and if they're an artist or if they have that mind to kind of think deeply, I'll show them this. Um, <laughs> I don't know whoever is still here. This is what I'm showing them. I'm showing them some of this work that I'm doing. So um, um, yeah, so we would start off here and then we uh end up kind of going with this we didn't like that we didn't like the face and we just kept i think we got pretty much we molded from a basic sketch to uh this right here it was off matter of fact 
you don't I don't have the off balance one but it was super off the crew helped to uh, help me eyeball it which is good good a aesthetic of teamwork um, good aesthetic of getting other people to look at your stuff and then taking your eyes off of it and going back to look at it so that was another key thing that um, we had did and I believe we got around here I played around with some colors I showed them I showed the crew how to do some uh, color tactics what I usually do when I come to colors um, how I layer or basically I let one one um, we built out the values with the with the sketch <clears throat> thinking of light thinking of dark thinking of you know these kind of things and I feel like something's a bit too bright I don't know where we um, happen but basically I'm not gonna base it off of these colors um, it was just like to kind of show what you can do and that's the kind of keys and stuff that I want to give you oh froggy what's up wave dash on you we're gonna be at YouTube if you want to see what I'm doing, it's going to be on YouTube. Sun Lane, what's up? Uh, Sandbox, thanks for coming through, fam. Thank you. Uh, he said, turn that mess down a bit. Uh, okay, set up right now. Cool, if you want it. Okay, uh, but really, you're good, man. Okay, cool. I'm going to turn the music down just a tad. <coughs> okay, cool. Hopefully, it's, it's good right there for you guys. Yo, James. James, I'm going to be at YouTube um, doing the live stream, so come through on the YouTube. I'm trying to get people more to the YouTube so um, YouTube look at, at my link in the bio um, in my link tree go to YouTube and then you can subscribe and you see that Kendall what's up Justin what's good with y'all okay so basically I was like I wanted to do these let's go to the story so I wanted to do their commissions I just wanted to start it and show you guys here but uh what this is how is this on my I've never heard this song so I'm like how is this on my thing um <clears throat> i'm sorry I, I know my playlist so <laughs> maybe i did add that like three years ago but i was going to personally do these alone in the dark and record it for j cole's recorder for aonix um the process that i go through and all this kind of stuff like that however i was like yo like i need something great to do tonight why don't i work on both of these and just kind of see how because a lot of times i'm always doing the roughs for you guys so let's see how do i take from the rough to kind of get it near more to um a complete uh type of thing one of the things is that i wanted to do for this one is actually almost kind of get a new pose so i wanted to bring in this guy our good old 3d model as i'm trying to use more tools um oh my gosh not paul come to youtube fam come come watch at youtube bro um link is in a bio not a man it's been a minute bro like i'm doing a class session at, uh, on youtube so please go to the youtube link don't just push like do it you guys do it like please support or at least subscribe and then then you can go home you can go you know what i'm saying but so we got this model right and i want to again advocate for us to start using our tools you feel me using all this stuff <clears throat> Also, too, yeah, Sandbox, if you guys want to know the tracks I play, let me know until I can get an app that will show it. Um, I'll bring it up. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go to a preset. At first, I was going to, you know, go and model this whole thing out. And, okay, cool. I was thinking this and thinking that. But what we're going to do is we're going to use a preset. And then we're going to build from there just to kind of cut on time. So let's look at we what we um, are going for. And then also, too, I want to bring up some of the reference that... Uh, Aonix and all of us was uh, checking out. Hold on, let me find out. Your boy trying to trying to do eight things, <clears throat> which is exciting for me. Um, I'm gonna just bring this in. Remember, we were looking at Siegfried, and uh, looking for y'all. We was looking at Siegfried, and we wanted to get like a. Uh, this is a heavy, you know, uh, broadsword wielding character, so we wanted to look at some different aesthetics, and things that are working in very. Uh, as far as an illustration and how to best sell this character with this big sword and and get the most out of it so <clears throat> that's what oh hey what's up oh hey Ky kayla kayla i always get your name wrong kayla your boy's at youtube deaf to cornbread your boy's at youtube go to the link you guys i'm just popping up here so you guys know that the live session is on youtube we're going through all kind of goodies you guys can see a full screen listen to music bop with it um please come through subscribe too let me give you all some wave dashes up in there real quick all right so um we were looking at that okay and i'm gonna cut this live in a minute all right so i can get real serious um with the class session 
um um so and i i don't know if i deleted those pictures or what but i just kind of want to give you guys sort of the vibe that we're going to be going with <clears throat> thanks kayla thank you for your support thanks for coming through definitely definitely thank you if you come through even if it's for a second that'll be a blessing um it, you know it'd be really dope so yeah okay guys so we're looking at this and we were looking at compositions too, how much the swords was taking up the composition, how uh, different artists was articulating certain things. So we wanted to learn from some of the dopest out there in the industry and um, apply that to what we're going to do. Uh, one of my main things in this class is to try to not just perform or anything like that, because I'm not no freaking, you know, master or anything, but to give us all freaking tools to freaking use um just like they do you know what i mean so um and show and like kind of just give give ourselves the upper hand in 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 trying to uh create stuff so uh let's go back <coughs> we did kind of like this direction so i'm kind of gonna go for like this uh whatever you see i don't know how to name it <laughs> so we're gonna go for that uh let's go back to our 3d dang i didn't know they were gonna um have ads when i'm doing the online I'll turn it down for you guys. All right, cool. Um, so we'll go to, uh, let me go to a uh, freaking, our 3D model real quick. And we're gonna try and get us something that we can kind of work with. And I wanted to show you guys this part too, because this is also a part of like working. This is a part of the drawing too as well. Um, just if I had a model in front of me or a doll or something like that, it's also a part of the thing. Um, so, Again, this is like more of that. It's a kneeled position. I'm gonna kind of see if I can like move him down. Let me see. Uh, no, I want to like move him all the way down. <coughs> yeah, this is good. Cause again, um, I also want to show that this stuff kind of takes some takes some time to do, and I think sometimes a lot of times we'll be rushing ourselves to accomplish like crazy stuff in a um, in a you know, uh, all pressured in a, what am I trying to say? <laughs> we try to like go faster than we're supposed to basically. And a lot of times this is a patient game, you know, so I kind of wanted to add all that as well. What up with it fam? It's been a cool minute. Give you a wave dash. Uh, we're on YouTube, bro. Um, the YouTube is a link. I'm just showing my face up here. Um, so yeah, come through to the YouTube and that's where the class session is going to be. Crawford, come to the YouTube fam. That's where the live session is going to be. I'm just showing my face here. But yeah, you guys see how we're, um, you know, um, I wanted to show you what it was going to take to do it. Um, I didn't want to just give you guys magic um, because this doing this stuff is tough. It's hard and I want us all to know it's okay that it's taken a while you know to to come up with something dope but this already is kind of cool let's go look at the image again so he's kind of um he's kind of resting on one leg right here and one is out so let's just try and do that um where's the window at we'll have this one out so i'm just gonna move this one over here i'm gonna bring him back down and look at that bro we already surfing we already surfing <laughs> you're hilarious well thank you that actually boosts my confidence <laughs> thank you say more <laughs> that's hilarious <laughs> all right cool um so let me get this down have him resting uh let me kind of see if i can rotate this uh kind of gotta know how these bones and all this kind of stuff work uh let me get off of this real quick let me press him a little forward get him up a little higher <coughs> um bring this uh we're getting there and you know what guys it's i'm not even going to do this perfect the whole thing is that this is just a stand-in because you guys saw me last week i used the stand-in and like i freaking just and that was the good thing about that I wanted to show about like knowing anatomy, how that starts to play a huge factor in the work. So, OK, cool. I think I'm just going to use this and we're going to use some we're going to maybe use we can use this as a camera angle to kind of, um, you know, 
uh, do what we can. But like, I'm kind of liking this. The sword would be probably be up here or something like that. Um, the thing is that we wanted to show the sword. That's right. <clears throat> I wonder if I should just change the whole freaking, the whole freaking, uh, dang, hold on. Oh, y'all ain't even got the music. But you know what? I don't think they're playing my music anyway. Let me, let me get my music up. The song is dope, but y'all can't hear it right now. But let me get this music up and let me turn off the, uh, all right, cool, everybody on the uh, IG Live. I'll see you later. Come to the YouTube, all right? Peace. <clears throat> Hold on, guys. All right. All right, cool. Let me get my music right, and then we're going to go freaking so in. Thank you guys for your patience. Again, I'm really fresh to doing this, but it has been an awesome adventure. Um, and I'm trying to get the right stuff. <clears throat> I wonder what... If this is not playing my like playlist, what is it randoming? Okay, it's just not gonna random it. All right, we're just gonna run through this mug then. All right, cool guys, I'm gonna turn you guys back onto the uh, music. <coughs> Let's get serious now. Let's get a little quiet. Let's get a little, you know what I'm saying? All right, cool. Let's get serious now. Y'all, you guys were patient. You three viewers were were patient. Patient people. Dang. I think I want this, but you know what? And we're gonna, I'm gonna, dang, how do I change his neck, his head? I might have to be a special rotator or something like that. I just don't want his body to change. This fool's gonna be looking to, to the side, looking towards his adventure. <coughs> okay cool right I'm not gonna worry about this a lot of this stuff I'm not gonna worry about this we just wanted to get like freaking body mass working <coughs> body mass working all right so I'm gonna put this in the other window right so you guys take a picture of that in your mind because that's what I'm gonna be looking at <coughs> all right let's get this out of here let's start start working with some 2d elements I'm also going to put this back over here too all right this is gonna be fun so I also want to say that all that stuff we were doing for two hours is still, it's still, how do I want to say this? It got us somewhere, okay? It got us to the direction we need. Yeah, we didn't finish a full illustration, <clears throat> but we got a freaking dope idea and we got a lot of stuff that didn't really, wasn't working towards where we wanted to go. So, um, and that was what our goal was. And again, with this illustration too, um, we'll work it in. We'll, uh, what am I trying to say? Uh, we are going to, uh, I kind of want that mess up like that. You know what? I remember this thing had the tongs. I think I might have this blade behind his leg. <coughs> and I'll push this coming more towards us. So again, we're probably going to have our perspective kind of moving like that, all right? <clears throat> so just have that in the back of your mind. Um, we were looking at the Siegfried. And yet, and that's kind of cool. I'm going to have his hand kind of drawing out in that perspective, all right? Very, uh, let's see what it looks like with that uh, kind of like this leg thing. But let me start thinking of perspective real quick. So I'm going to think of this is going to be kind of closer. And I'm already like, ah, I don't know about this. But let's kind of just keep going and kind of see what we can do. <coughs> we want it to feel right. Um, let me see. Let me just kind of really block out kind of the idea. So this right here totally doesn't feel good to me. Um, <laughs> we got it. We're gonna. And um, I'm embarrassed in front of you guys. No, no, not really. This is all the juice that we need to show, like how we start. We could start have a rough start, and this could be the right. St it's always the right start. Starting is always <laughs> the, the the best start you can do. <coughs> okay, let me kind of look at the ref. This arm is kind of. Again, this one was supposed to be going towards us anyway too 
So I may keep that. I may actually may have it in front. Okay, let's think of our blade here. If you guys want to know what this track is, this is from your boy that did Neo Tokyo, a game that I think came out probably 2009. It's a first-person shooter. Uh, I forget the the uh, the uh, his the 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 guy making the music. <laughs> I forget his name, but uh, just look up Neo Tokyo. Neo Tokyo. I f don't remember if this is actually for that soundtrack, but this is how that soundtrack sounds. Um, and it's almost like I, maybe if his chest, I'm trying to think if it'd be better to, kind of customizing here. And I feel like I want to start a little bit smaller, just so I can, we can see this again. We talked about starting small. And I'm going to pull up the chat too, just in case anybody's talking, so I can see what's up. <coughs> okay, nobody talking. <coughs> um... Where, where y'all at? Where's the, where's the viewers? <laughs> just kidding. I'm blessed with you guys that are here, and I'm just enjoying it. That's the whole cool part about doing this, is I found myself enjoying more doing it than kind of like, it, where, where are my viewers? Where are the likes? I'm like, dang, if I can enjoy this without the likes? Oh, shoot. Then we can keep being ourselves? Oh, this is the juice. And this is like, again, kind of why I should be thankful for these times, why I should be thankful for, um, and I want to breathe that to you guys too, why, hmm, I'm looking at this pose and trying to drop some dope knowledge, because <laughs> I'm not really feeling the pose yet right now, <coughs> um, um, say right now, like again, we all want more eyes on our work, we want humans, as humans, we want, um, to be validated we want to be known we want to, uh there's a word that starts with a and i can't think about what it is uh i don't want to say accept it but we want to be yeah let's just say accepted right usually we call exception with numbers or likes well at least in this age we do um and so uh if we're not getting that sandbox thank you for still being here thank you for rocking bro even even if you're doing something um somewhere else like yo thank you that you you just got this in the in the back <laughs> um but we are looking for validation and we're looking through that stuff so i think it's cool that if we can do what we love to do first and enjoy it to the fullest um be f and not worry about all that stuff and as that stuff comes we can still be who we are still bring the stories that we're here to bring and not have to sacrifice who we are um, and the dope ideas we have just to try and keep reaching numbers and keep reaching numbers and all this kind of stuff like that. <coughs> so um, I feel like we're kind of getting somewhere, but still not. Um, I'm still not quite feeling it. So I think what we're going to do is just keep going. I'm not going to, uh, usually I would be hard on myself. I'm going to kind of silhouette this. <coughs> and um, I'll turn that down for you guys. Um, we're going to uh, see what we can come out. You guys have any ideas? That would be cool too. You guys can always let me know. Um, we can do, uh, starting to think now of, now I'm thinking of like kind of like the other stance that uh, Siegfried has. It'd be actually cool maybe to even do something like this where that mess is like freaking huge and he could be holding the tong, the tong thing right here. And it's like, I don't know how big this blade is, but <coughs> I'll make this mug freaking mad huge. All right, right here. This is Riku Nets, um, and I'm pretty sure this is the remix from... Um, uh, Tekken 2 uh, character select screen which is one of my favorite tracks uh, even back in the day I want to say two th no I want to say 97 <coughs> we was rocking that mug on the PS on the PS1 <laughs> listening to the soundtrack yeah I think I might want to go something like this and I may change this leg maybe just have it maybe a little bit towards us a little bit more <coughs> or something 
could even be like that. So again, very blocky, but we're just trying to establish some some stuff. <coughs> Which is totally fine. We are the artists. We can establish what we want. Establish the rules. Um, I think we're going to have them at least right now. But we want to establish this so we then we can go in crazy and start getting details just like that one, okay? <coughs> So, uh, let me see. We're going to do this here. That. Only thing is, <laughs> it's just like figuring out if this is going to work. Actually, this might be kind of dope because it's kind of like gives this whole movement thing. But I wonder if, and I'm going to have to choose something because when I make a move, then I have to then I have to make moves everywhere else. <laughs> so <laughs> I'll do something that I think feels cool, and then I'm like, "Will that work?" And now I'm like, I want to freaking change this whole thing. <clears throat> I might want to change if I'm gonna have this kind of progressive movement, And I could almost have his arm. And we're going to go with this, guys. And I'm going to stop. <clears throat> this arm is going to be like getting ready to grab onto this, this uh, bar. And that's, where we're, that's, that's what this is going to be. Composition, we're going to have him over here. We're going to have a big room for the blade over here, though. Okay. So we're going to use that same tactic that we saw um, many other artists using as far as splitting up the composition. Uh, like kind of like in thirds, right? So again, that's going to take up most of the composition. <coughs> oh, I forgot to turn the music on. Uh, I'll turn it up for you guys a little bit. All right, cool. Just as long as the lyrics don't get in the way. So yeah, this is where we're going to go. And I could, let me copy this real quick. So I want to see if extending um, this leg will help us. It may not. <coughs> kind of have to figure out how that's working. Have this more. Yeah, but we're, I'm going to stick with this. Because we can keep going on forever and ever and ever. And we're not going to do that. We don't have time to do that. <coughs> that's another thing. Already put in a lot of time. And, you know, again, it's not good to rush. But we gotta we got to find a... We gotta find a uh, find a place to put our feet and build. <coughs> Can even have his head down. Yeah, have his shoulder up. Okay, yeah. Let's figure out this. Let's see if we want this up like that. Have that up action. I don't think of an S. Let me see if we can get some S language in here. <coughs> Could even have that up like that. But yeah, that's gonna be our jester. We're using that and we're gonna go. <coughs> Kendall, thank you for being here too. Yes, you guys, you guys are strong. Thank you. I hope you guys get since you guys are here, I really hope you guys get the most out of this. Like I again you can people can watch this later, but I really hope I, I thank you guys for, for rocking, for staying, for enjoying. And I hope even right now, if you guys are working on stuff, yo, work on that stuff, you feel me? I'm going to turn this music down a little bit. And um, I'm actually going to skip it. Oh, what's good? oh, it's my boy. Okay, we'll go to this. All right. So I really, since we worked on this so long, I really want to get into it. I really want to get in and start building stuff. So <coughs> let's do that. Uh, what I'm going to do is... I think I am still going to use this sketch for um, for a uh, and let me go to uh, Aonix's notes because he was like yo you could actually do some other stuff with it so I was like bro let me do that <coughs> so let me go to that real quick hold on one sec guys so he was like yo you can have the helmet off and all this kind of stuff so I was like oh freaking G I think we will uh, 
go and do that. Ionics, where are your notes at? Um, shoot. Oh wait, Ionics turned his uh, changed his thing. I was just talking to Ionics today. What are you talking about? Okay, hold on. <coughs> Let me see. Uh. Okay, no, that's cool. We're gonna keep the helmet, everything like that. <coughs> we are gonna have his hair come out though too. So let me uh let me start doing that too, getting that in. It's just gonna go right along with everything. <coughs> uh, but yeah, we're gonna start vibing. We're gonna start f really filling this out, and we're gonna make a dope. We're gonna actually make a really dope, like dope illustration i say that because yeah of course that's the goal <coughs> uh he said he couldn't find the, the uh link in the bio i wonder if i have that link in the bio i should <coughs> but um Yep, it's here. Okay, cool. I'll talk one of them today. Okay, cool. So, I already, I'm just going to start. Actually, let me add a little bit more light. I remember we talked about light emitting from his blade. So, I'm going to put like a white spot there. We'll have it like maybe, since that would be the important part, I have it like bounce up in here. And I'm going to move in just a little bit. I have some stuff kind of bouncing here maybe some stuff bouncing here and again <coughs> I'm not being super selective as you guys can see I'm not going in and saying okay here's the helmet right now here's the side of the face um, I know that's the face I'm just plotting light and dark right now and then we'll go in and start then detailing I'm just kinda plotting where most of that is and I'm doing it very raw as you guys can see maybe something going in there this too we still got to kind of figure out how this leg is going to be like really working <coughs> okay matter of fact um let me add white underneath this because i'm gonna use the paper to uh and simulate some of this tone <coughs> hmm, what happened uh no i don't want to transform Okay, cool. Uh, let me go back to the chat if you guys say anything. Uh, yeah, yeah, nah, this mess feels good. Again, well, stop. This uh, this is going to give us the, the freaking breath of life. Again, a lot of, you know, trying to start with a strong gesture is going to really, one, get us excited, get us a feeling of, like, what the end can look like and that kind of energy, this energy in here or whatever. We want to rem remind ourselves of that. Like, oh, where was the energy? Where was the feeling at? So that's why I usually like to keep uh, this raw because I like to have that energy stay in my work somehow. Because when you start developing it, it can start to, you know, uh, lose that energy as you start adding all these different rules and, you know, okay, the light is here, this is that, you know, all this kind of stuff. You can kind of lose all that. <coughs> I'll try to remind myself to turn this back up for you guys. I didn't think the desktop version had uh, ads, but I guess they do now. And then, yeah, you just get artistic expression. Um, it's just kind of like my artistic expression uh, that I get to kind of keep into the art. <coughs> So this we'll have to figure out like how this hands work, how this arm, but I do want this shoulder up here, that up there. He's gonna have a helmet. So I'm just gonna kinda do that. <coughs> so Bob a flip from uh, Sonic 2, I believe, or was it Sonic and Knuckles? I think there's a Sonic 2. Y'all didn't know, I'll be on my game music, bruh. I've been on game music all day. 
come come with it <coughs> all right cool so we got some juice here this is great this is great and like I think what I'm gonna do now is start I'm gonna crop it I'm gonna, I'm gonna think of like what we want it to look like at the end <coughs> um, yeah let me see I think that's control X to crop and just kind of give ourselves a feel and then be cool to even have that you know again I like kind of adding that shadow adding the like shadow adds a little bit more reality if I'm just gonna use this back this white background which I'm gonna do I'm not gonna and do all that other stuff so <coughs> alright cool um let's get into it what time is it 744 okay we still got some time mm. let's go blue mm. final fantasy bot <coughs> Seven, the uh, uh, the uh, victory fanfare, which is the best one. I remember the first time hearing it, and I remember my life changing after hearing it. <coughs> I literally changed right then. I said, "Thank God." The biggest change was God. Second biggest was probably hearing this song. All right, cool guys. I'm gonna go back to um, some of the ref. Let me see if there's some on my desktop because I don't know where I put those images at. I do not see them, um, so I'm going to actually here. I have some right here. Annex character, okay? So let me drop that. Let me actually drop that. I had that in the file already, but I'm just gonna drop a picture. I'm gonna drop that there. Actually, hold on. <coughs> I'll just put it actually in there. So put this mug on the side. All right, cool. Um, he said I can customize things, so that's the fun part. Um, let's go in with some pencils. Let's have fun with some pencils real quick. <coughs> okay. And let me just kind of get an eyeball. Looks like there's a lot of cloth going on, so not like really any hard surface, which is cool. Make sure that we got a belt, a huge kind of belt, and then I think the rest I'm gonna just really custom and just kind of have fun. <coughs> And just see what I feel. I like a lot of this right here. Just from the strokes. Like I know I'm going to want to do something with that. And like either have it feel like a plate. Or something. Now. Um, from the ref. He does have. Like this uh, scarf type of thing going on. And. Um, we're going to rock with that. We're going to. We're going to. We're going we're gonna to obey the rules. And sometimes like, oh man, I gotta figure out this scarf thing. But I got to obey the rules. Matter of fact, I should kinda go back a little bit. <coughs> Let me kinda like anatomify this. <laughs> Anatomy fi. And you know what? Let me check the size of this thing, this file real quick, because um I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger. So <coughs> Let me see. Fix that. Let's just go to a resolution of 450. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I don't even know if it did anything. Mm, I don't think it did anything. I don't know what that did. Because <coughs> I want the whole thing to, to jump, to grow. Let me see what happens if I put like 4,000. Oh, I was going to go with it. All right, cool. Um... This may take a second. Uh, Black Ace, what up with it? <laughs> it's like, what did I miss? You missed everything. No, I'm just kidding. Nah, we just redrew, resketched out the. Uh, <clears throat> um, Black Ace, Black Ace, are you? Black Ace is J. Cole, right? Because I can't remember. <laughs> he has this difference on the thing. Which kind of. Uh, yeah, I got to remember who everybody is on the difference from the YouTube and all that. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to kind of sketch in this because I need to know kind of what is going on with the body if what I'm doing makes sense. And I only could do this because, or I'm thinking like this because of the level of anatomy that I've been studying. So this is what 
as you guys start as we all start to grow we'll start thinking more about like does this really work in reality does this really you know um and it's not that it has to work again we have um creative freedom but um say for instance like for me i want my characters to have a real i don't want to say realistic but a, a um a type of weight to them that is very uh that is uh based off of our reality you know so with me studying anatomy that's one of the things that i've been trying to get better at um and so like again if you guys are studying anatomy and want characters that feel like they either fit um i mean it's just good in general even if you're doing things that are just more out of um you know a different concentration or whatever um understanding how bodies work is only going to just make your characters feel uh weighted in whatever world that you're creating because again you're basing it off of rules there's always rules <coughs> that uh connect us to things you know sort of thing like that yeah okay so um that's what i'm thinking of right here i'm loosely going off of what i remember in anatomy and trying to see if this all works because it feels like his head is going to have to rise up a little bit more. <clears throat> and what I could do, actually, I think I want to just to rise it up a little more, change the perspective of what's going on. Maybe even, like, I don't know, he's looking up because he's about to, like, freaking slay the dragon. You know, so we're going to think of that. Let me start flipping this thing. It's just like last time. Remember how crazy it got. <coughs> Yes, J. Coles. Just, yeah, thank you for reminding me. We're going to get to yours too, so hold on. I just wanted to get, I wanted to get some things right with the uh, freaking Aeonixes. <coughs> so I'm kind of got to think about that shoulder. Sometimes I forget about that big old, I forget what it's called. But um, I'm reminding myself that that actually exists here, okay? Say eyes here, say a nose here, say a mouth. But again, this character is going to have a mask. So, But it's good for us to know what's underneath that mask. So when we put that mask on, that mask actually works. <coughs> so um, we'll go here. Okay. Kind of have some of this stuff going. <coughs> like that and um, yeah so yeah you guys continue to keep on studying that anatomy keep on doing them gesture drawings I've been gesture drawing every day um, well I can't say that actually not every day but picking it back up and man it's like after you do that for like 21 days you'll start really seeing like oh shoot like Cause I was like drawing like just without any reference and I was like yo my stuff got better it got better because I kept looking at all these nude bodies and and drawing them and understanding how things were working like my brain was doing a lot of work for me <clears throat> and I was just like wow like that mess I mean I've seen it work but I just haven't seen it work like that so yeah that's why again i'm like trying to preach yo bust some gestures bust some gestures and like kind of use it as a gem keep smashing on that <coughs> you feel me like keep on all right cool so i'm gonna kind of look at this without um i feel like this leg is a bit small um a thigh so i'm gonna move it out a little bit and then um what i'm gonna do <coughs> is uh I, i'm gonna jump to j cole's this is another thing that I, i'm trying to teach so is bouncing that's what i call bouncing um i don't know if it's for everybody but we're gonna do it today and it's something that i i like to do because i just like to do a lot of stuff <laughs> and i know how good it is to to uh 
take a break from things, you know. So usually I'll work on two or three different things and bounce back um, from, you know, each one. But again, um, again, I just wanted to remind you guys where we started out and how, again, all these tools, it's not like the, the 3D model was supposed to, like, it only came through just a little bit. It came through a lot on J. Cole's. Like, I was able to use that 3D model and, 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 like, really use that post. This one, it just sparked more inspiration for what we got right now. And so that's why when I'm like, yo, use these tools or whatever, it's not that the tool is, like, going to be the answer, but it can be, like, 10%. <laughs> and that 10% is adding to, you know, where you're where you're um, going, you know. So I uh, want you guys to always be... Uh, <clears throat> um, I was going to say cognitive. I don't know why I wanted to say that word because it sounds dope. Um, but I think that's the word. I, you know, be cognitive that your work is, is uh, all of your efforts are, are being applied to what you're doing. No matter what level you're at or what. And it's, I shouldn't even say level because, um, <clears throat> I mean, I can if I wanted to put a number or put a a thing on your work but it's you're always going to be growing um n you're always going to want to get better so it's not that okay i'm at this level now because when you're even at like say if you're at a different level i talk about this all the time you're going to want to get to a better level <laughs> you're not going to be like oh yeah i'm at this level now i can chill now now you know all the enemies are easy now and um because go to the next dungeon and freaking everybody else is freaking high level and you just want to keep going up all right cool so um i think we got some juice here guys i think we we finally have a pose that's dope um we start we have that guest gesture and so yeah we're popping right now um so let's take a break Let's go to Jay. <clears throat> Let's go to the Kings. All right, cool. So again, with this one, we're gonna go in. My, what am I saying? I'm about to say four words at once. We're gonna go and um, blue this out, and we're gonna go into our pencils again. Take the color out, all that stuff. Let's get nice and um. Let's get nice and comfortable here. It looks like I <laughs> dueled the pencil. Um, so I'll, I'm going to take one out. And um, what happened? <laughs> what did I take out? <laughs> I'm like, which one is this? This is the overlay. Okay, whatever. <coughs> I get I know what I just did. Okay, never mind. We'll go and pencil this. Um, and I'm trying, as I'm doing it, I'm going to think about the notes that J. Cole gave me. Um which I think we're pretty um, I'm gonna turn down this just so that we can um, kinda see my lines a little bit better I think we're already like in a good direction and so this is good so like I can um, try to think of how to um, how to draw this thing basically <laughs> So, I mean, like, might be, I kind of want to have her hand, like, the hilt resting right here. And I'm trying to think it would be cool to see if her hand was kind of open and it's just kind of like, and the gloves would be dope. Gloves would definitely be dope. So, I'm going to try and kind of articulate a hand here. All right, I'm going to skip this track because it's my boy and... Um, the lyrics are gonna, uh, y'all can't even hear the music. <coughs> I keep forgetting to turn it up for you guys. Alright, cool, let me see. Uh, yeah, 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 Okay, cool. Uh, let me skip real quick. I just wonder why this is not, like, doing random like I wanted to do. But let's try to think of this glove. This a this a buff right here. This a this a head knot. Oh no, I'm trying to be cool. Okay.
something else with this one too it had like a really cool design and remember I talked about we're not gonna worry about that in the pre sketch but right now we can kind of uh, dial in some dope some dope vibes for the uh, guard thing I should have brought up uh, the ref let me bring up dang it <clears throat> I'm not gonna no, you know what no 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 I'm saying nope when I should be bringing it up, but uh, we can worry about that later. I'm trying to think. I think it had like some guards too. So I'm thinking very European, very uh, classic. <clears throat> it's gonna have a jewel somewhere in there, and um, I'm like, should this be a like a sword it should be a sword i think he wanted it to be like a full i mean it's a sword but like i mean is it like a rapier or like a a sword sword so i think it is we're gonna come back to that later this arm is feeling so strong so very thick i think i kind of want to see if we can get a little bit more shape out of it and it's hard because uh, to kind of get this jacket, we want that rigid, rigidity, that rigidity. Um, but we also want uh, to show a little form, just to just to be nice. <coughs> mm hmm. Yeah, thanks, San. So I'm um, trying to think of how maybe this ripples would rip underneath this belt. Um, I kind of want to, don't want to get too wild, but we, do, I do want some kind of authenticity to it. Um, the belt would be kind of tight, not tight, but it's hugging to her body to keep the clothes on, I guess. So you know, as it pierces you're going to get you know the tension from it so we want to show that but we got to think also too how this material would tension <coughs> fam he's back thank you. welcome back <laughs> i'm like thank you for coming back uh, yeah yeah so um i'm gonna kind of think of that uh, those ripples and i don't want it to be and like now that i'm thinking about it and i'm looking at it it's kind of we want to make sure that that doesn't because it was like kind of coming out like this like here's the belt and it felt like they were like doing that kind of don't want that so we're gonna just feel our way through also too I'm trying to think um, whoops Play, what is going on? <laughs> what is happening? I like the curve in this. And it may not be uh, like how real jackets do, but this one is going to do it. There's that artistic freedom that we have. So again, an area that I also need to work in is like drawing folds and stuff like that. So I'm going to do an attempt the best that I can here. But in my mind, I'm like, I can already tell, feel myself saying, do you, would it really work like that? Or would that be the best move to make and stuff like that? So I know that, hey, I really don't know how to fully articulate this. You know, that's an area I need to put on the list of things I need to work on. And that's totally fine because there's like 8,000 things on that list and there's always going to be that list. So if you guys feel the same way, <coughs> thanks. Yeah, if you guys feel the same way, then um, just know that that's fine. Oh, I want to get better at this. I want to get better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all do. We all want to get better. So, yeah, just make sure that you're not negative to yourself. Ah, oh, why don't I? Why don't I? Cause you're a human, you're not perfect, you know. You can always grow, you know. 
off the two track plan I think this is a flip from Objo uh, another dope producer uh, I think he hails from Brazil I'm not too sure do not quote me on that so I'm trying to think um, cause this, it looks like just a block right so well, that kind of did something. <clears throat> okay. Well, I was just pointing out it was a box, but I think we figured out something. Something to help give this part life. Kind of add to it. I think I'm going to have it underneath. This is dope. This is very, very adventurous. <clears throat> Still want to figure out how I think that would curve in like that. I mean, it sounds like Final Fantasy 13, like some Hamalzu. Um, let me turn this up a little bit for you guys. I don't even know if you can hear these bops. <coughs> um, hold on one sec. Let me, um, cause I want to know what this is. Oh, I wonder how, did Hamalzu work on this soundtrack? This is from Musashi, uh, the second build or the second game that came out, probably PS. Um, I forget when that when that thing came out. Um, dang, I looked at her mouth and I was just something I didn't like. <coughs> I said we would deal with this face later too. So I'm not gonna. figure it out. I think I want a little bit, see if we get a little bit more sharpness. Um, just a little bit of like this hard, you can kind of feel that she's, uh, should be more of this, that she is uh, not eff messing around. Not effing around. I was going to say that. I was afraid. Why was I afraid? I don't want to get on anyone's nerves. But <coughs> yeah, we kind of want uh get that that type of feel also too with their eyebrows we'll have that kind of going in a little bit so just a little change here we'll have that come and come in touching almost basically like the lid this looks a little aggressive <coughs> but we'll rock that to be too kind of pudgy. <coughs> Octopath, huh? Decisive battle from Octopath? I don't even know if I've heard that. I don't even know if I heard of all of uh, that sound. I feel like I did. Alright, cool. I'm going to probably, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to jump on that in a little bit. Please remind me. Oh, I've never played it. You uh, freaking dope. Yeah, freaking G. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. We will fight on. We'll see. I just want to make sure this is all working. Alright, cool, guys. I think this is a. I feel like it's a slight flip from uh, Final Fantasy 13 to. Um, but this might be the actual song from the thing. One thing I do like, what was happening here, kind of showing that her chest and bringing her chest out was really cool. So, no line. <coughs> I want to have this part a bit tight. Hmm. How would her hand be? Might be coming in. 
<clears> hmm. <throat> okay. Uh, no. Let me go back a little bit. If we're handling this, maybe like she's uh, putting a fist on her herself. Mm hmm. I'm just like kind of looking at the arm, looking at what we can do. We know it's got to be in here somewhere. We just got to figure out what it is. And also, what I like to have these fingers kind of going. It's not, <laughs> not really working. <laughs> Something like that where we're getting it kind of going around like that. But uh, nah, I'm gonna erase that real quick and I'm gonna like think. I could actually go get some reference to, to figure that out. Or I could just make it a pocket. No, nah, we're not gonna do that. We're not gonna cheap it. We're way more and we need to, we want this to be a fist. I'm gonna try one more attempt. And then after that, I think I'm going to look at, uh, get some ref. Matter of fact, let me just see, what would I do? Let me put my hand on my wrist. Okay, I kind of feel what I would do. Let's see if it's going to work here. I kind of like this too. I don't want her like holding, like, oh, this is my waist. <laughs> That's what it's feeling like right now. And then it's her waist is like going out really wide. I'm trying to think, which is nothing wrong with that. Um, just does it match the other side? Whoa, what the heck is this? <coughs> Something like this. Wait, what is? Oh, this is a. Uh, I think it's Danga Rampa. I forget what it is. It'd be kind of cool. She had a firearm right here. She's like, yeah, don't, don't touch me. <laughs> mhm. Mm <coughs> All right, cool. I'm gonna kind of deal with that later. A lot of times too. Like, I'm letting the lines make the rules, but when we start going back into painting, I'm gonna use the values and the paint. I'm gonna use everything to really start making the rules. This is kind of like our solid outside outline rule, but the tone is gonna be telling us stuff, and then I'm gonna get inspiration from that. I'm gonna get inspiration from the color, and all the different parts are gonna start building off of these lines and everything like that. Um, we just need to figure this out <laughs> and yeah but this is really cool I think this um, some thing is gonna be kind of cool and really establishing this freaking dope glove we still got to put our badges on <coughs> supposed to be on our right chest uh, but we got this hair in the way so Aonix I'm gonna cheat this <laughs> I'm gonna use the hair and maybe show like just a little bit which is c could kind of say something too like um, it, maybe her beauty is hiding or to let's let's say it like this her beauty is hiding all of this the merits that she actually has done and people look at her beauty before her merits you know before you know, understand that she's accomplished all this stuff, and maybe she doesn't wear it so boldly, like, oh, these merits make me. Instead, she's like, no, I make me, you know. Uh, these are in the back, like, but what's in my heart and what I truly am is in front, you know. So her hair covers it, you know. Um, so that's more storytelling, and that's more sub, I want to say subconscious. It is kind of more subconscious, but you can 
think of your characters like that when you're illustrating um, and also to kind of helped us in production because now I don't have to ultimately think of how to get all those uh, <clears throat> everything in there but I know there was an importance about having the one patch I forget what it was called um, that she repped um, and that could be a huge part of this story or her strength or you know all that kind of stuff so <clears throat> I want to make sure that that uh, um, that is not left out so um, shoot what am I looking at why am I looking at all this stuff <clears throat> oh my gosh <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry y'all uh, I'm seeing this thing and I'm like tripping okay let us um cause this is pretty solid we'll figure out the uh and I wonder too if we want actually it might be cool to not have hair cause I kinda want it to kinda come out just a little bit more um but we want it to make sense. And the Ionics, if you want her hair longer, because I, I was thinking, I don't know, we can have a little coming out the back. This kind of helps with the whole silhouette of things, <coughs> too. You can even make kind of custom this. But yeah, we can start getting the more details when we start getting into um, painting. And I may st also ink this stuff, too. Matter of fact, I'm gonna ink these lines. We're gonna do it all. <clears throat> um, yes, Jay, send that ref if you can. I mean, I can just find you. I just go look at it real quick. Hold on, Jay. Don't worry. It was just about the patch. Um, you have wrote the notes to me, so uh, sitting on top, rage, real large scar. Okay, da 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 da. U H A into her uniform. Okay, along the the pins. This is about the United. Okay, so uh, J Cole is like right now how the U H A uh, it would be in the way. It would be, it, I think it's supposed to be here somewhere, but I have this hair going down and I want to utilize that. Do you want me to change and do something else putting UHA? Do you want me to, to have that in here? Um, Cause then I can change. Uh, matter of fact, let's just do something real quick. Just in case like um, I had a client and he really wanted, like it's really important that this illustration has that UHA. Then, um, you know, maybe I can come up with something else where the hair, uh, I don't know. Somehow where it's showing, um, <laughs> where we put that patch in there, you know. Again, the outfit did change. I did add this here. Um, and I don't know if that's going to complicate everything. <laughs> but, you know, and I'm, you know, how this patch is supposed to work. Um, I'm not too sure. <clears throat> okay, cool. He's going to send it to me. So while he's sending it to me, we're going to go back. I'm gonna go back to this guy and start um, busting this out. <coughs> okay, I'm not gonna. I don't think. Let's look at uh, the ref real quick. So I'm trying to think of that blade. So it's pretty straight on, straight on. Um, um, you guys, this is a chrono trigger flip. So yeah, please enjoy it. Okay, so what I'm gonna do real quick is just, well shoot, I can think I can use this right here. It's just gonna come out like super hard. Okay. And you know, it'd be like, you know, like foom type of thing, right? <coughs> Yay, we got a blade. All right, cool, so that's that there. Um, Trying to see if it does it touch these hilts. If that's the right name for them. 
But uh, let's start to uh, possibly put some clothes on this guy. <coughs> so I'm just going to do that on another layer. And we're going to think of how this clothes is like sitting on him. I think we're going to use the scarf in this to give us that motion. Um, and I'm going to like kind of turn this down a little bit just so we can see. Yeah, I'm already liking what's happening. Um, <clears throat> let me look at the ref again. Uh, let's see. I thought, yeah, so, so it's kind of like a wrapping scarf. So we'll kind of think of it wrapping around type of thing. It's a loose sketch. Um... I don't know if I want this to be skin tight. I feel like, or some kind of. <coughs> it's kind of mesh or something like that. It's gonna have this gauntlet just cause the, you know, looks like the gauntlet's kind of outshine and then there's black. Or, he said I can customize this all. <laughs> but we'll just roll with that gonna be that hand I'm drawing over already my sketch uh, let's try to think. <coughs> hmm uh, yeah you guys Kendall knows what this is I was drawing hands earlier, so some of this anatomy, some stuff that I was practicing, which is kind of cool, I came to play. I feel like that's a bit too long. Though. <coughs> okay, cool. I'm about to go check that image out. Well, I'm going to check it in a second. What time is it? We got 8.20. We got 40 more minutes. Mm. Oh, yeah. I was also going to tell you guys this, too. If you guys have any um, advice on how I can make these streams or market these streams or get these streams or to make them better, to make them more understandable, to have it be a fun experience, please let me know. Um... Because just like an artist, I want to grow and and just, you know, get better at the things I do. And when people give me dope ideas, I'll be the first one to jump. I'll be the first one to capture on it. <coughs> I want shoulders showing. I want muscles. Uh, let's see, think of that. <laughs> Matter of fact, I think I'm gonna start giving points. <laughs> start giving points for anybody who knows what song plays on the soundtrack. I wish I could do something like that. I'm gonna figure that out. <coughs> I don't know how this all gonna work. You skip bragging rights for right now. Yeah, so Kendall, where's this from, bro? Let us know. Anybody who knows where this song is from, let us know. Is it loud enough? Can you hear it? <coughs> Matter of fact, this, uh, this, um, I wonder if this chat, yeah, this hand right here, this feels like kind of small to what it needs to be, so I'm gonna pump it up a little bit as it's kind of coming near us. This, I'm gonna just make it a little bit bigger, um, get some Street Fighter S huge hands, <coughs> and as it's kind of back here, it may kind of help out. That thumb is looking mad huge though. I'm gonna kinda turn that down a little bit. <coughs> yeah, my boy on it. Oh my god, bruh. <laughs> Let's freaking go. <coughs> um, outfit, outfit, outfit. Okay, I think the rest, I'm just gonna like make sure he has a 
huge belt and then the rest I'm gonna use uh use my imagination so again simple forms <coughs> Aonix is back fam welcome <laughs> so yeah this is uh, the new version <laughs> <coughs> Ooh, you can get the recap um later, but yeah, I'll watch it later. But yeah, we uh we did some things to the art. <laughs> oh, we gotta make sure this works. All this works, and if this is in front, that's the thing. We're gonna have this weird tangent going on here. Um, so uh we have to make sure that they kind of don't conflict. We don't want anybody getting lost. Song is a freaking banger. That tech and tag, bro, gets you hype. All right, let me see. Um, let me see. Uh, what is next? All right, guys, I got the. I'll turn down the uh, what you call it? <laughs> yeah, we up on this, man. We up on this. So there is like this, uh, I forget, I don't know what this is called. It's kind of like a loincloth like uh, type of thing that's happening here. And so uh, we want movement in that, so I'm going to put that there. I think there's one in the back too. I think you have one in the back. So, And here it looks like some, well, dang, I can't even draw on that. Yeah, it has, nah, I see what's going on. It's like almost a third, a three-piecer which is probably gonna kinda go back <clears throat> I think um, maybe we'll rock this maybe I'll have some kinda conflicting I mean, not too long um, I was gonna say like conflicting so this going here and this is like going there so that's why I think I want that up there plus I want it to feel like he is moving um, so I don't think we're going if it's something here it's gonna be like there and I might have it like rise up a little bit but still even with that I'm just trying to see how this would work and I don't know maybe I should have this kind of moving more too just some ideas real quick let me back out so I might do some more customs too. <coughs> um, actually, you, Aonix did some customs. Okay, I'm gonna make this. I'm gonna make it simpler for me, and I'm gonna just run with what kind of comes. Um. I'm a, hmm. I think I kind of want some some wave dash, wave dashing on them. Oh, <coughs> um, <laughs> just so hilarious me thinking of this full wave dashing all quick across the stream. Freaking uh, melee style. Alright. Um. Let's get some uh. Let's get some shin guard type of coolness going on. And maybe some kind of. Protective knee wear, maybe. <clears throat> or something. I don't know. I probably have a feeling. I'll come up with something. Something. <laughs> it's hilarious. If we wave dashing all across the screen, you're like, "Damn, I did not know he was that fast." Um. Uh, let me see if anybody knows where this is from. I'm already forgetting. Oh, I know where it's from now. Okay. I was like, wait, what the heck is this from? I don't think 
if 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 you if y'all get this, I'm gonna be like super hype. <laughs> I don't think anybody's gonna get this. This is a dope track though. <coughs> and I don't, don't be trying to Shazam that mug. <laughs> well, y'all can't even hear it. I don't even have the volume up. My bad. Ah, uh, I'm gonna rewind that just for y'all. Hold on, man. Hold up on this mug. All right. Anybody can tell me what this is. Super kudos. <clears throat> okay, I feel like I want to put this back in. Um, because I feel like I want to get some vibes from it to tell me how a lot of these forms are going to be. I want to use this. <clears throat> so let's clean it. I'm going to move something that I... I think I'm not nah, because I don't want to waste time doing that. I just freaking gray it out. <coughs> I'm gonna use some uh some water smoother. I'm gonna start moving that now. I'm starting to use the sketch to. I'm starting to fill in the sketch with some ideas we had. See. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're hilarious, Aonix. <coughs> uh, so, Aonix, you know what this is, then? <laughs> it's hilarious. <coughs> if you know what it is, just tell me. Tell me where it's from. I think you, the way you, you, that last comment makes you, makes me think you know what this is. <coughs> and then you gotta tell me the composer, too. Man, something feels missing here. Let me put on the water. Actually, it might be cool to... Actually, I'm going to use that. Okay, so see how we have this... Let me scoot all up in here. We have this... This is like... Shoot, hold on. <coughs> nah, not Blade Runner. Nope. It's actually from an anime that had released... I want to say... Oh, why is this all the way down? Anime that released, um, actually, I don't, <laughs> no, I don't want that away. I want to say 2000 and, uh, no, not Cyberpunk, um, 2000, uh, freaking, like, three? No, 2006, 2007. <coughs> it's like a huge franchise, though. Um does have to deal with cyberpunk and it has to deal with android type things beings people um <coughs> i'll tell you guys the composer i don't know if that's gonna help you guys uh composer is yoko kano she does a lot of dope stuff but she worked on this project um so yeah <laughs> this guy kendo you're hilarious the way you say it though <laughs> you got me off that's where it's from <laughs> You're like, I think it's this. <laughs> yeah, I think they used it for actually one of the intros. Um, so yeah, I'm just getting the tone because I'm a remember, guys. I'm using this whole under sketch. This is gonna be a part of the thing. So that we're leaving it and that we're messing with it. <coughs> it's fantastic. All right, cool. What I wanted to show you guys was like what started to come into my mind when I looked at these this uh, value so we have this dark middle value you see this right here and then the rest is kind of light this can already kind of symbolize the type of material that this is you know what I'm saying <coughs> yep ghost in the shell ergo proxy hmm that's a good one I don't even know if I heard all of that Steins Gate that's a show I need to watch too but like cuz uh I don't have time to I mean I can pull up metal but what metal, the type of material, it has like these very hard esh, since it's so shiny, it's so precise in like displaying light and dark. So the lights are usually like very super bright, like usually shine marks. And then like the, again, I don't know all the science, 
but the darks can come out like really dark and you'll get that really cool metal so I saw that and I'm like bro let's just use that for the idea of this leg and remember how I was gonna go in and try to pencil this whole thing and I said you know what no we're gonna use our sketch to come up with ideas too so that's what I meant I wasn't gonna try to figure it all all the math out right then I could you know oh this design could do this you know but I was like nah let me let me use this freaking sketch let me use this uh this uh what we already got <clears throat> I'm trying to use this water brush and it's kind of smearing where I don't want it to smear so I'm going to use an oil brush real quick <clears throat> just to kind of I think I because I want it I want to break this I want this to feel like you know and I can kind of go on even with that that smear to add some cool stuff but even my knowledge of metal would have to um, kind of in heighten to like really capitalize on this stuff but it's just stuff that I've seen, like uh, the, one of the artists, Saboteur. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> He's still putting down, still putting down different. That's hilarious. You are hilarious. <laughs> like, I don't know about Apple Seed. He's putting down every, every like spot in the joint. That is hilarious, man. That makes my night, bro. I'm going a, I'm to a stream next week again now just because you did that. No, I'm just kidding. But no, I am. But that that's awesome thank you for uh being hilarious Aonix. but you guys look like we're already it's forming now this is the stuff that i wanted to show you guys this is how i start to form ideas i always i'm always using sketches and stuff to build off of i'm letting them fill in the spaces i mean instead of me just going at it by like I could have like okay this is gonna be the leg here and I'm gonna have this design here and I you saw me I kind of sketched it as an idea but I was like okay wait I made that whole tone thing before let me see if I see something out of it. it's like did I see something in the clouds so <clears throat> yes yeah, sandbox thank you and so like that's how stuff starts to form and as you can see now we're kind of getting into more of that illustrative you know processy um, part of doing the work it's starting to mix in now with um, what we're doing and now this is where you can kind of lose yourself and doing all the details and everything like that and if you do that that's fine especially if you built up we build up a dope freaking pose we build up a dope jester so like the more we we have a dope base you know what I'm saying and I like what's happening right now like look like we're that that this is like doing stuff already I'm already starting to see shape and form in here and I'm gonna just kinda like highlight some of those things like I'm seeing muscles now it's kinda like um, it's like to me again like looking at clouds and starting to see little things here and there in the illustration and so this is how I start to build um, and the more that I know about human anatomy the more I'll see in the clouds you know what I'm saying the more and uh, you know and the more that you know we play around and experiment the more you know you get to do you get to uh, play around with I'm gonna kind of darken a little bit I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna do and, and then again I, I start thinking like a painter like we did sketching now I'm thinking painting now you know and I'll be probably going back and forth but uh, I want this like this right here I want that to stay that uh, light part actually I'm kind of screwing it up <laughs> it's gonna have a nice little edge that um, what was I? I was about to say something I was about to say uh, what's that move you do um, edge guard <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be or if I'm am, am I saying the right turn I don't play a lot of smash but you know we are uh, you know the edge battling or whatever um, so you start to see different things like that and using things to uh, explain forms what is this so you take everything now look we got painted form here rest look kind of kind of crazy 
you know and then we throw those pencils on and it's like oh starting to make sense so <coughs> but yeah I just want to show you guys more and more how a lot of times this stuff comes to be it comes piece by piece um, you know um, especially um, with illustration type stuff uh, you're carving you're molding you know you can mold um, and just learn what you like uh, that's easier said than done well it matters who you are maybe I'm always somebody that's always liking new stuff and trying to do new things so you know and I'm always trying to challenge myself challenge myself right now doing this in front of you guys <laughs> so <laughs> you know you're doing a live stream you know that is a challenge in itself you know so I always want to show and um, implore you guys to challenge yourselves you guys can do live streams too let me know let me try to jump on that mug uh, coming together man and thank you bro thank you man this is a uh, um, that is a great compliment I'm gonna say thank you to that Coles like and I just want to continue to inspire you guys of your own freaking power too and like I want to see that mess performed I want to see you guys keep growing <clears throat> but uh yeah this is how these things start to perform I mean how they come to form <laughs> to perform uh, this song is pretty dope um, it was for the CEO um, CEO 2016 I guess they used it I guess they made a whole soundtrack for CEO which if you don't know that is a gaming tournament um, and I forget I think it's usually in Atlanta I forget where it's at so um, yeah they made this freaking dope song I'm gonna skip it though right now y'all could uh, hear that mess later uh, we got a near automata flip um, so I'm going to turn this flip up a little bit because it's a little soft. We're going to vibe to this real quick. <clears throat> Alright, so we got that. Let me go look at... Uh, shoot, we running out of time. Let me go look at uh, what J. Cole sent me real quick. And... Um, oh, that's, that's a pretty dope design. <clears throat> I can't find it. Give me a quick... Okay. Uh, with... Similar to the symbol, okay. Da 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 da. Showing the letters worked into the image. Let me see what you got. Okay, cool. Okay, let me. I'm gonna jump back to that. Oh, I can just keep that on there. All right, cool. So let me jump to Jay's real quick. And then also too, remember, we're gonna throw that back in there. Not that one. We're going to throw this goodness back in there again. Because remember, I'm going to use that to inspire the next moves. <clears throat> we we don't like wasting any freaking thing. Um, originally had the hair there. Uh, but we want the patches showing. We're going to, again, um, challenge ourselves to have this patch showing. And still have that beauty. Again, I can always put the hair on the other side. But I want to see if I can keep it on this side and still um, keep those vibes going. I don't know why I'm coloring the lips right now, but it's all good. Um, okay, I'm going to have to, it's going to take me time to really go. And what's cool is that I could have this like area, this patch area actually be the piece that's holding her suit together which is kind of cool too as a story unit like this holds this holds together now when you like again like for film for comics like you know everything like that getting all to the nitty gritty like that is fun as heck and it's so cool for the readers and the viewers especially the people that are really into it to see all the little ideas and the things that you've come up with to symbolize this character so you guys are always going to see me. There's a like little gnat flying around. I have no food around. I don't know why. Um, but you guys are always going to see me try to implement story in these um, in in these uh, illustrations. Anything I do. Um, because I love story. And that's 
why I'm doing art is because I want to be able to uh, tell stories in in what I'm doing. So I'm always practicing storytelling in what I'm doing. <laughs> wow, this looks pretty interesting. Um, but uh, let's start. Is this our original pencils? What I'm going to do is kind of darken these. I'm going to lighten our uh, value layer. Okay, just so we can rock with it, we can work with it a little bit more. So I'm going to use that tone curve like you guys saw. I'm just kind of build it, bring it all the way up so we can kind of see our pencils more. And um, <clears throat> we can come up with some, ide some ideas. Um, I thought I would accomplish more. Um, but you know what? This is great because this tells me that work is being done. And this is usually everything. I'm like, oh, I thought I was going to get done with this in like two hours. And that mess took a little bit longer. But what I'm glad is that I'm starting to not see that as a failure, but seeing this as a win, seeing this as a fight. And I want you guys to see your stuff as a fight, too. Sometimes we be working hard and like we be like, this is all I got done or this is how this came out. This is not what I was thinking in my head. This is a freaking marathon you heard that a lot embrace each freaking uh stop sign you pass by embrace each step of this journey this is the juice you're going to be living off this is the the juice that's going to feed your family you know what i'm saying we got to embrace that nobody may really even understand it but us you know what i'm saying nobody's like Nobody ever sees me in the middle of the picture and is like, yo, man, this is... Well, nah, you guys understand, but you know what I'm saying? So we got to hype our own selves up. Like, we got to super hype ourselves. Let me turn this mug down a little bit. <coughs> um, I'm going to just flip this. Uh, We're going to bust with a Final Fantasy. Oh, it. this is actually like scrambling it now. Okay, cool scrambling the stuff okay um also too let me leave a room for questions all that kind of stuff you guys please let me know um give me some um dang it where's the chat let me know how you're feeling let me know if you guys um got questions and everything in this last couple of 15 minutes um any shout outs any ideas because i think from now oh my gosh i don't know why I, okay this is what i'm gonna do i am gonna do Y'all know how much I love the color, so I'm going to color on both of these mugs. We're going to get a raw color in. We already started some on uh, <clears throat> on freaking J. Cole's. So I'm going to bring that back, and then we're going to vibe with it some more. Again, I'm always trying to show color tactics. <clears throat> we're using the value to do the, a lot of the work already. This right here, I'm going to see. Let's just see what was happening, uh, what initially we painted. That's what that is, okay? Some straight... Um, solids right and I show it with having dang this mug is too loud in my ear I'm sorry this me <laughs> yeah, I'm at the let me change this mug real quick um, with those values that we have the values the gray white black you know all that stuff on there <clears throat> those can help build form look at that there it's already doing stuff for us um, it's giving us because uh, we built a foundation and it's already going to set us up, right? So um, this is a, and I'm all I'm doing is changing the uh, blending mode of that color of how it lays on top of our grayscale, right? Um, so um, I'm like, what am I gonna do now? <laughs> what am I gonna do in ten minutes to be all cool and and all that kind of stuff? Um, I'm going to get a little bit wilder, basically. I'm going to go a little bit wild with you guys. Why? Because I feel like that's the only option. Go hard or go home, right? <clears throat> so we're going to do it again because I'm going to try to do it for both of you guys. image. And what I'm going to try to do is possibly give ourselves a concept of the final. Um, it's like I'm going to, I'm working at a studio and I'm like, or, you know, working on a film. Like, Yo, we need to see what... Gabrielle Union's costume is going to look like like now. Can you give us something strong? Okay, fine. Let me show you what I can do. 
and then you go back to uh, your desk and you're like what the freak do I do how do I how do I do that so I'm saying it's like I got a ton of no I do have a ton of experience we do believe in, in ourselves yes we do I'm not gonna speak down on myself <laughs> and I'm practicing on that you guys so if you ever hear me just like stop talking that's because I'm changing how I speak about certain things <clears throat> why because words are powerful and we need to be saying some dope we need to be saying more powerful words um, in our in our uh, our vocab needs to change yours may be dope I'm working on mine so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to um, I'm gonna think of this character as a tube right and I'm gonna put energy in a place and I'm gonna have our cooling area right so um, I've been doing this a lot more just kind of testing out I'm gonna have this be all very cool down here why I don't know there's not that much energy in legs just kidding there's energy everywhere but and I think I'm gonna just kind of bring the focus here so I'm gonna think again thinking conceptually um, let's have this be red right again we're just giving it the spirit okay it's just an idea all right <clears throat> and we'll build off of it all right let's get this out of here we don't need that it's a little bot too let's see what else we got though <clears throat> I think this is uh, what happened I paused it I think this is a uh, fear of dark Nah, we're not gonna listen to this one. It's gonna be too crazy. All right. What is this? I forgot. So um, I'm gonna add a little blue up in here for the bottom. Again, this is also what I like to do. I don't even know where her head is. I don't know what's going on. I'm thinking straight spirit right now. <laughs> and I love doing stuff like this because um, it gives me a chance to experiment and kind of let go in executing kind of come up with some stuff I didn't know I can come up with so that's why we're gonna do this I know that this jacket I'm gonna have this kind of run off into her jacket and I'm just thinking of some dope feels you know just with color and stuff like that <coughs> oh man Alex uh, I totally missed the track that you needed <laughs> uh, uh, dang it I wanted to help y'all with that dang it um, Annex, maybe I'll just link my um, this like list. I'll send it to you. Um, anybody else that wants it, let me know. I'll send it to you guys on like a DM or something like that. So yeah, I've been starting to do stuff like this, and maybe I'll add just a little blue in here. Um, and let me think if there's any. I don't know. I just kind of want to get wild. I think what I'm going to do. I want to add a green in here for some reason just to be just to show that you can do crazy things and make some dope stuff if you see the clouds hold on let me uh, make sure so yeah I'm gonna kind of outline I'm gonna kind of bright um, the track before this one let me just go back real quick this one this one I don't know Oh, this freaking funky beat one? Let me know if it's this funky beat one. I'm gonna let it rock. <coughs> yeah, you gotta get the funks in there. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of that. So sometimes I'm like, I like some uniformity. <coughs> um, I think I'm gonna see what this looks like and then I think I'm gonna color on top of that. Um, but you guys see, we're, we're doing stuff. <laughs> We're building creativity. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? And then I can just, again, now this color base can become something. Yeah. <clears throat> um, and sometimes I do this just to like freaking re rejuvenate like the idea, rejuvenate myself. Um, <clears throat> When I'm like, oh god, this, I'm so bored of this art. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> That's hilarious. Yeah, I would like send the playlist somewhere. <laughs> oh my god, she's like, leak this to me. B, you be having like some dope music too. <coughs> Matter of fact, let me, dude, I'm gonna just put it in the mug, right? 
I'm gonna see if it lets me put in the chat because for some reason it was like, yo, you gotta log in. I'm like, what the freak? SoundCloud.com, you likes. I don't even know if this is gonna work. Um, I think it has to be like, let me see if I can go somewhere. Let me get this to you guys real quick. Uh, no, these are view. I wish I could like, uh, let me see if this actually works, okay? I'm gonna see if it changes the URL when I drop it. Um, sign into chat. All messages you send will appear publicly. Oh my gosh. Help me. <laughs> oh wow, I had to do it like, okay. Um, let's see what happens. See if you guys get this. <coughs> it's gonna say you likes and I don't think it's gonna work for you guys because it's not saying it's me. I mean, it's like saying it's mine. And I'm like, bro, like, I know it's mine. I want it to be for me. I mean, I want it to be for you guys. <laughs> so stupid. <clears throat> okay, I'll just send you guys to my profile. And then you guys can just go to uh, my likes. Wow, never. Sh I used to be afraid of sharing all my music. Now I'm like, nah, it's music. <laughs> You guys, do, like, we love music. <laughs> Share. We need power. <laughs> we need to help each other. All right, cool. Um, so, yeah, hopefully you guys got that. <coughs> um, check out the stuff. I even have a track on there if you can find it. All right, cool. So, shoot. Hold on. <sighs> yeah, so here we can have fun. Okay, yeah, so go to the profile and just find the play, like a like playlist or something like that. I have like different albums and things that I like, but look for the likes and then shoot. I have like 640 likes, so I don't know how you're going to find this track. <laughs> I'll tell you what this track is. But yeah, it's a, it's a lot of, a lot of, a lot of cool juice. But basically like in here, you know, I get more foundation, more inspiration of where I can take the illustration. Um... Let me just do this one, turn this down, two overlays. <coughs> uh, Kendall, oh my gosh, you remember that? <laughs> yep, it's still there. <laughs> my freestyle. Uh, your boy is a hip hop maniac. Um, well, I guess you could just hit track one. That's me, me and my brother. Okay, so um, let's go back to that color. I'm gonna try and see if I can um, use this and still um, possibly use this base <coughs> um, to kind of bring it home. So that's our regular brown, that regular tint st skin tone. Um, doing a multiply, I have to like, this is where things kind of get, get tricky because I'm trying to bring it a middle a middle ground to it all um, and if I had all let me let's just go back let's just do this real quick I'm gonna just solid this whole thing and I usually don't do my work like this but this actually no we want the gloves to be like I want them to be white <coughs> but um you can see how like you can Portion out creativity. Instead of like trying to do it all at once, portion that mug out. Yes, that is what I want to get to. Um, so yeah, I want to... Whoa, 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 whoa. We're portioning it out right now. Um, I'm kind of down with these... Uh, actually, I'm going to kind of try to keep it all uniform. Just to see what happens. Maybe the pants are just a tad bit light. Okay, and remember, I'm trying to utilize the work we've already done to use creativity on top of that. Um, remember, I do not have all day to do illustration. I have a day job. You guys may have day job and have other things to do, so it's kind of cool to start, like, um, finding ways to build creative stuff and. Um, I don't know, in a uh, fast way. <laughs> that makes Man, you guys, your boy is trying. All right, let's just make these boots black or like a gray. 
<clears throat> or something like that. We'll just put a dark color for right now. But yeah, just solid colors over the the uh, crazy stuff and um, our tone. Let me pull my chat up. <coughs> hmm, play. All right, cool. I'll try to link that song. Um, oh, you found the likes. Okay, dope. I'm a, I'm gonna find that track. Everybody love that freaking the jiggy. This mess is called Keep with a flower. K E E P. Um, let me just go to it. I'll just pop it up in here. This is dope. <coughs> mm-hmm. Vibe with it though. <laughs> so I have more time. <laughs> Bro. <coughs> I wanna find my new job too. We're working on that. Cause I want more time to be killing this mug too. Okay guys, it's 859. I'm supposed to be off at 9, but I wanna do some rough colors for uh um freaking aonixes but see you guys like we can and i'm like taking a step back take a step back we can build off it you can do solids that's fine if you have like some of the tools underneath it like you can do stuff you know and the only thing i'm trying to do is we just want to get a little bit more it's a bit i was going to say fruity but it's a bit um, fruity as in like it's just very like a lot of colors happening uh, which is it can be fine if you want that expression <laughs> oh my gosh you're like let's freaking do it now let's build games hey that's coming bro that's coming that is definitely coming um, but like basically you know even if we go with a soft with the crazy colors and we go with a stronger of our solids you guys can see how we can, we're really like, I can almost take this, smash it all together and just start putting in finishing touches. But that, that is how I kind of go at things. I'm building, I'm, I'm, I basically, uh, shoot connecting dots. Let me explain what I'm talking about. <clears throat> If you guys realize, I didn't finish anything. I didn't finish a full crazy sketch. The sketch was still sketch. <laughs> the colors were still the colors was sketch. The uh, the um, our values things was sketch. Everything was sketch. You know, um, to get something like this. Now sometimes it's good. It can be good to keep things sketch, and sometimes it's good to go in. You know, like this one and you want to really understand that value in the in, in the painting you know um it matters the time you have it matters you know your levels again i talk i don't really like saying levels because it's hard to explain what that is everybody's so different but um yeah like this is how you can crank out some some stuff and show somebody and say hey we like that you know let's progress on it and then that's when you can start going in and painting you can just go in you know if we're all using digital you can go in and just start um like say for instance i'm gonna do it right now real quick um i'm gonna merge it all into one layer right <coughs> and i am going to um kind of just start painting in there you know and i showed a little bit this uh, the other time wow you know I could do that but however when you do this it can be a good thing and this can also I have found myself making myself more problems <laughs> because it's like it's still a lot of problems everywhere you still got to figure out this you got to figure out that you got to figure out all these different things so um, that's the thing that happens when basically everything's gonna take time it's all gonna take time whatever route you take just know it's going to take time um, but this just kind of gives you a this way gives you a, a concrete idea and you can focus on where to put that time again like a lot of the stuff answers are like this hole right here is good 
I'm just gonna smooth this all away and say okay that's that answer this right here and <laughs> like a lot of times I'm like just going in like smoothing stuff out which you gotta kinda watch out because you don't sometimes just smoothing things is not it's gonna feel you're gonna lose kinda like uh, it'll start meshing into one big thing <clears throat> but yeah I'll just kinda like solidify certain things you know step back solidify stuff and then you can find out okay this is where you know I need to figure out what this is and then you can start attacking your 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 art you know what I'm saying but you already have like a strong base that you can work off you know what I'm saying so again everybody's different you guys will all do your things different ways and I'll be learning from you guys different stuff that you guys do um, so please uh, keep working keep drawing and keep sharing so we can keep stealing from each other like real heroes do uh, to become dope and um, and sharing playlist and all this kind of stuff you know but yeah you know that's what's up that's that's how we can start building and that's probably how I'm gonna start building this illustration um, J. Cole I do not remember if he had specific colors <clears throat> for all this so I'm gonna have to uh, come at you at that um, you know but yeah and here you can start getting artistic with certain things you know and then you can always just use another layer and draw on top of it that's you know what I'm saying use the program use the tricks you know could probably have this like actually fade down <clears> or <throat> some some way I don't know. I figured it out. But yeah. Add some uh life into like where's that other freaking colored thing? There's some other stuff, some other jazz. Um but yeah. You can do that kind of stuff guys. We have the magic to do that. I'm gonna do one more thing and then I'm gonna go to uh Aonix and then I gotta get off I gotta eat something and then your boy gotta go uh, take his take his sleepy take himself to the bed and rest and get up really early in the morning and uh, try and hash out some more dopeness <coughs> I just extracted the lines of our illustration and you see this cool little sketchy goodiness that it gave us that it gave us that it gave us <coughs> um yeah I freaking love this. Uh, let me see. Uh, let's see. Level uh, let's, uh, comprehension and understanding of art relation to your current. Okay, that's dope. Yeah. Specific just for the uniform. Uh, uh, let's see. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So, if there's any specifics that you want as far as the colors. Or if this, you know, kind of color scheme is fine, let me know. Um, but yeah, I like to try and see if the extract lines, that's this button right here. If you have clips, extract, and it's going to take your, I'll show you guys what it does. It does that. I think you guys already saw that. But um, And you can do this to like images, and it'll like make that image look like somebody had this like type of sketch lines and, you know, just the way it, it converts. Um, the stuff you know so you can use that sometimes I use my own painting to do that over and I come up with some really dope stuff I'm always experimenting always testing things out because I'm always trying to learn and grow but yeah we're getting stuff you guys can see we're getting ideas and yeah I kind of like where things are going I'm gonna do one more thing that's a tone curve and I'll like push certain things just to see what direction we should take it and then once I get another solid like feel of like yo I like this um, then I will probably smash it down and then paint over it again but yeah um, cool and then you want to draw a background do all that kind of stuff you can do that okay cool let's move to Aeonics is real quick um, let's because this is still in a super rough version so let's just have fun with it um, 
I'm gonna look at his colors again <clears throat> and we're going to um, simulate a lot of that in here I'm gonna first yeah let's just be simple and do just straight some straight flat colors I'm gonna take it from the actual image um, is this what I want what is this is this a new layer that I made I don't know okay so we'll go do that real quick and throw these guys up in there um, I'm just gonna take the colors he has of course it's black I don't want it to be totally black because I wanted it to well to tell you the truth <coughs> I'm gonna draw it black and you're gonna see with the values it's already gonna change that black to be lighter and darker wherever um, wherever my grayscale is underneath it <coughs> Uh, so let me see any more like black areas that I want um, I don't know if I want this black I want, I want a, maybe a little color maybe a little gray I don't know we'll just do this for now we'll just do all this we need something solid anyway um, actually kind of light these shins up maybe a little bit light these boots up we'll get this here but yeah, it's just to give an idea, that's all. But sometimes you want to inspire yourself. <coughs> you don't have to wait till you're finished to inspire yourself. You're the director. <laughs> you find that whenever and wherever you can. So I'm going to add this blue up in here. <coughs> I think I'm going to add... Um, yeah, I'm going to just keep this in here. And I think I kind of maybe want to dial it back just a little bit I'm trying to see what other areas I could add I could put it all let's just put some in here anyway <coughs> yeah we'll keep it solid too just keep everything solid <coughs> and uh, I think we'll just go gray with the belt for now could like have this part dark too I'm going to the blue is usually just in the middle, so I'm actually going to just add black on the sides too. Just to see what happens. I just want to see what's going to happen. We'll add light in here. Yep, cover everything up. This should be like kind of all light too. I could already do some crazy color stuff, but I'm not going to. Let's, see, let's just make these hilts black. Handle black. Um, blade does have some silver type stuff here going on and um let's hit that blue the blue magic the blue force put that mess in there um well not really kind of have that mess freaking lighten this blade up <coughs> juiced Alright, cool. And, um. Yeah, I'm just gonna like. I feel like, uh. Actually, I kinda like what it did. I kinda mixed it. <coughs> Which is fine. So, there's just some solids, real quick. Some of this stuff is not even covered, colored still like a lot of holes so like if I take everything away still missing a couple of things but it's cool uh, we just trying to get some inspiration all right cool uh, let's throw in some crazy all right so I'm gonna take all this off I am gonna think of heat again um, yes I'm gonna put it like some all this up in there maybe something in there um, maybe where the knees are bending these freaking thighs, these freaking thighs are freaking on fire. <coughs> um, no, I'm gonna ride. We're gonna ride with that. And um, maybe just a up a little bit. Let's start. I think of blue. Sometimes in this, I'll think of the shadow, um, and I'll apply that with the color. So I'll like leave some purple or something like that, if I want to. And then again, we're just having fun here. Maybe like more red edge as it seeps out. And then we'll let this blue just, yeah, 
that so just like a lot of that heat and then it just seeping into like cool energy <clears throat> put the spirit put the spirit in there you can even kind of do that with here too kind of like what what it's saying just kind of let that rock let that rock Uh, maybe a little heat in the chest. Let's heat them up. Um, let me see. Let's see if I get in here. Excuse me, are you the wisest person in the world? Yes, I am. Turn this down for you guys. All right. Um, and let's see what magic we can come up with. Let's see if something cool happens. I don't know. Sometimes you you don't know. <clears throat> okay, so. Ugh. Juiced. Alright. <clears throat> I'm like, we're done. This is, this feels fun. <clears throat> so, um. It's, it's, so, it's so many choices I can make. Um, so many ideas. Um, usually I always start, I, I don't want to say always. Sometimes I start with an overlay. That's just kind of like overlaying the color over the, the whatchamacallit. Um, <coughs> and let's see what happens when we add our color. What we can do with the color. Um, I don't really see anything happen. <laughs> I don't really see, um, and it could be due to the type of colors I used. <coughs> okay, let me see. I want to try to get something. Let me, uh, let me do this. I'll put the color on and see what, uh, we get so yeah like you guys can already see I'm getting ideas just from this chest area like of like armor or like how the um, how this the armor or how that shirt is like clinging to his body <clears throat> and we made that move a long time ago remember I was like oh we'll put light here we'll do that you know now it's coming into play all those little things are like starting to come into play so um, you know, your boy loves scavenging, loves trying to keep the doors open of um, inspiration. Um, and now I put the this color stuff on top. I think I'm going to lighten it up, go 50%, and just kind of see how things sit. And it just may just kind of give us an idea or give us um, some juice. And this is it flipped, which I kind of like. Um, there's something about it that I like. So when I see something I like, I'll just copy the layer and I'm going to keep that one there and I'm going to play on top of that so I still have that difference layer right here you guys see that I still have that and I'm going to just turn this one on and see if I throw anything on top of it if I can get even some more interesting stuff you know now this is a bright this is kind of flipping stuff again just like kind of the opposite of a subtract <coughs> You know, but it has like a lot of that, um, some of these blue, uh oh, where's the reference? You know, I'm thinking of these colors and it kind of has a lot of that like floating in there, which is kind of like what I like. I didn't know we were going to come up with something like that, but I think I want to kind of keep that vibe. And, but I still want to add some like warm and cool juice up in there too. <coughs> uh, let me see. All right, cool. Thanks, J. Cole. I'm going to uh, check that out, bro. Because I should have a finished one, a finished piece for you guys soon. Uh, let me see. Um, or finish to what? Yeah, this is a free gift, so <laughs> finish to the best that I can um, get you, which I want to get you guys quality. But we still got a, I got a lot of work on deck. Um. So yeah, but as you guys can see, we get some crazy stuff up in here. We turn different things off, turn them on, see what stuff looks like. 
see what we want to play with, see what you want to keep. Um, I think these colors are very interesting. Um, uh, you know, trying to capture that same, these same colors, the same feel, and maybe bring something new, something new to the game. So yeah. <clears throat> oh, sorry guys, I forgot to like turn your music back on. <laughs> I was listening to some vibes, um, but y'all got to listen now. But yeah, um, yeah, I think this is gonna be about it for class today. Just more exploring, more uh, tools that you guys can use. Um, again, remember we use that 3D poser. Matter of fact, let's go back and just see what, um, how much of it we actually used. I don't know. This is that pose. <laughs> Do we use? Let me see. Let's look at our stuff. Eh, we kind of used some stuff from it. I shifted the knees, the legs, and all that kind of stuff. So, uh, but yeah. So right now it's just really strong, really concepty, um, and we can uh, decide where we want to take it from there. So. Um, I'm going to uh, try one more thing and then I should stop. I should stop eating. I want, I'm hungry. I want some pizza. Man. Man, it'd be, it'd be dope to eat some pizza right now. It's your boy Sifu Aya. Uh, another killer. <coughs> okay, cool, guys. Um, your boy's going to get off. And. Um, feels like, again, I can keep going and keep going, trying to figure out what's the best feeling for this. Um, but yeah, that was it. I better stop, because <laughs> I'll just keep going. So yeah, fans, uh, thanks for coming through. <clears throat> Bro, I just used that program for, oh, for the, yeah, the freaking uh, poser? Yes, please. <laughs> That's hilarious. Black, you want this? Uh, let me send this mug in a link, alright? I was about to turn that mug now. Um, let me send this in a link, and then, guys, we're, I'm going to head out of here. Um, dang, hold on. I'm like, where are we at? Let me, let's look at this little 3D pose. Uh, let me go back. Yeah, you can find a see-through on a freaking... Um, see through on this is somebody else just posing not posing as see through they just uploaded his stuff but you can find him on um freaking uh soundcloud in the soundcloud yeah you can find some but uh spotify probably like apple music and all that stuff like that uh see through is a g see through a y e a uh i forget where he i forget if he's from the neverlands i forget where he's from but Okay, guys, um, it was a blast. I'm going to eat food now, and I should be delivering these commissions hopefully in the next week or two to you guys all finished up. And I thank you guys for going on the right and watching this and coming and supporting and liking. All that stuff is good. Remember, that helps this to keep going. Um, it also inspires me to want to keep bringing the best game, bringing the stuff. You guys let me know if there's something you guys want me to concentrate or see for class. And uh, we're going to keep it rocking, all right? Okay, guys. Um, have a blessed night. Be safe. Be conscious. Be smart. Be prolific. Be awesome. And uh, we will see you guys soon. All right. Peace.